try to come back to you. Uh, let's try one from Jamin Moore. Hey, Jackson. <laughs> Good to talk to you. Start of another season. Nice yeah. to see you in person last week as well. Yeah, nice to see you guys as um, well. Hey, uh, so obviously first game of the year, you know, compare kind of where you feel uh, you're at as well as where you feel, you know, your, your teammates are at in terms of approaching this season, you know, in this opener versus other openers. Obviously on the road is always a tall order in MLS, much less in an opener in an environment like Atlanta United. But in terms of your, you know, execution on the field, you know, how do you feel uh, you are prepared for this season? Thank you. Yeah, um, I think, you know, with how preseason was formatted um, this year with the two extra weeks, you know, I think we were able to play multiple um, MLS teams. Um, a lot of games, you know, a lot of guys were able to get good minutes in, in these competitions. Um, so I think the team is, is feeling really strong and, you know, ready for Saturday. Um, you know, I think, um, you know, Lucci and, and the coaching staff has, you know, came in from day one with, with the game plan and, you know, tried to get everyone integrated. Um, you know, you could see um, the progression from, from day one till, till now um, that it's, um, you know, everyone's learning. Um, getting getting on the same page and, and eager to kick off the season. So in terms of preparation for this first game, I think the guys are going to be going to be flying. Um, you know, we had um, some good some good games this this preseason, and um, we're looking forward to, to kicking it off in, in, in a hard place, but um, you know, definitely a place that um, you know we feel we can we can go and, and start the season off with three points. Thank you, Jackson. Uh, next up, Ted Raymond. Hey Jackson, what's going on, man? Um, just you know, how do you how do you feel about your game right now? I mean, I know that you have been through uh, a lot of work over the last couple seasons, um, but you know, you you looked fresh in practice when we've seen you. Do you feel pretty good right now? Yeah, yeah, I feel um, you know motivated. You know, I think we have a strong team. We're able to bring in some 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 good players. Um, I think some some other players are are getting older and, and more mature, and I think you know. The cohesiveness as as a group, I think, is is really strong. Um, you know, for myself, I think you know playing a little bit more of a um, a progressive role this year. You know, getting in into higher higher spaces and, and into the pocket, and you know, working working more with um, you know Jamiro and, and Jabo and, and the wingers higher up on the field, and um, you know, so e eager to get in and around the box and, and create more chances this year. Um, but yeah, uh, ex excited to start start on Saturday. Thank you. Uh, this question comes from Pavi Renkel. Uh, his question is, uh, what do you think of the new MLS playoff structure and what are your first impressions on that? Um, yeah, it's, it's interesting. Um, I think there's a lot of season to, to be played first. Um, so we're you know focused just on um, the game this Saturday in, in Atlanta um, and then each game following that. But um, yeah, you know, I think MLS is always trying to um, you know be creative in, in their formatting and and get um, a good competition for you know for the fans and and for people to watch and um, so we hope to be in it first of all um, and that starts on um, the Saturday let's try to do a couple more um, and go back to Jamin Moore for a second question Hey Jackson, um, so uh, I wanted to, to talk a little bit more about the role. You mentioned being a bit higher on the pitch. Would you call what you and Jamiro are doing? Are you more like double double eights, double tens? One of you is more of an eight, one of you is more of a ten. Like, how would you describe like the relationship with with Jamiro uh, in your uh, in your role? Yeah, I think um, you know the great thing about both of us is you know we like movement. Um, I think it's pretty fluid in in both. So I would say you know it. It tends to be an eight and an eight, where we're we're both kind of dropping in in lower spaces to receive the ball, but also um, can both play as a ten. You know, I think sometimes it's me dropping more and 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 Mito staying um, a little bit higher in in the pocket. Um, so I think you know that creativity and, and fluidity of of the you know being able to switch between the two, I think helps you know destabilize you know midfields and, and defenses. Um, you know, I think it also will depend on you know who, who we're playing and you know what kind of their strengths and weaknesses are um, but yeah you know playing playing with him in, in the midfield has always been fun because you know he's able to you know float around in, in many different areas and and you know pick up the ball and you know escape 
Um, so I think throughout the throughout certain games and throughout the year it'll change. But um, yeah, I would say we're both um, kind of still in that role of, of box to box, and you know, especially you know in the attacking area, trying to trying to get in and, and finish some goals this year.